friends today we are preparing a low cost low glycemic load wala atta for preparing roti vagaira at your house the price per kg of this atta will be approximately 200 only the ingredients are we have taken 500 grams of uh, soya bean seeds and uh, we have taken 50 gram of badam and 50 gram of akrot walnut 50 gram of pumpkin seeds 50 gram of uh, sunflower seeds 50 grams of uh, uh, watermelon seeds 50 gram of roasted flax seed 50 gram of uh, chia seeds 50 gram of uh, white till 50 gram of desiccated coconut powder and uh, 50 gram of uh, roasted peanuts so this uh, this is our ingredients this we have put it in hot sun for at least 2 hours to remove moisture content in these seeds after that we allowed it to get cool in the natural way and we are going to make into a powder form of all these items individually and separately friends now we have made powder of uh, everything now i will show you each one one by one this is a soya bean 500 g powder this is almond 50 g walnut 50 g pumpkin seed 50 g sunflower seed 50 g watermelon seed 50 g flax seed 50 g chia seed 50 g white till we have not uh, ground into powder we are taking it as is varies and also this is a desiccated coconut powder already in the powder form and uh, this is a uh, uh, um, groundnut uh, roasted uh, groundnut seeds see excepting uh, the soya flour all other flours you have to do it in the pulse mode only the grinding part of it please do not run the mixi continuously because it will leave the oil and it will form into a, a thick batter like instead if you try it through the pulse mode you will get powder like this now friends now we have taken a, a tupperware uh, plastic container so that it is air tight to that we are adding one by one all the flours and we are going to mix it together to make it the combination of the powder keto powder friends now we have added all the flours together we are mix we are going to mix this well so that all the ingredients will get mixed together properly
we have prepared this uh, on the basis of the statement already shared with you the glycemic load of 100 gram of this flour is only 4.5 so this is a very low glycemic index uh, food with which we can prepare our roti paratha vagera so that uh, it will give you it never will increase your sugars to the extent of what a wheat flour will do so this is very safe for you to eat it this way see the consistency of the flour so this flour we are going to keep it in the airtight container we are going to fridge it so that this will not get spoiled for a longer period a longer duration as and when you are going to prepare the roti kindly take the required quantity of this flour add salt to this add warm water for making into the chapati uh, flour and then you prepare your chapati out of it by adding isabgul powder for giving the binding effect. The quantum of isabgul powder to be added is approximately one and a quarter teaspoon that is around six grams of isabgul powder per roti should be the consistency with which this uh, flour is to be mixed with. Uh, to give the binding effect to this flour. So we will also show you the preparation of the roti at in a later video. So now friends this is low glycemic soya flour atta for preparation of roti paratha vagera at your house.